Hi, this is Steve from the future. I had the wrong microphone input set for the entirety of the recording of this video. I'm not going to redo it, so please just enjoy the really bad audio. Hi, I'm Steve and this is Abandoned and today you join me on an unscripted video where we're looking at a map hovering over Liverpool Road Station in Manchester. Uh, today we're going to be doing something a bit different, this is what I'm going to call like a map adventure or a map journey where we're going to follow a railway line from A to B and see what interesting features we can spot along the way. Well, it doesn't have to be a railway line, it can be anything like uh, a canal, a road or a routeway. Today we're going to be following the Liverpool-Manchester Railway going from Manchester out towards Liverpool. Whether we'll get all the way to Liverpool or not is a whole different matter, depends how distracted I get looking at the maps. But we are starting here, the current map series we are looking at is the... Um, OS 1 to 1, no, 1 to 1056, uh, 1840 series. So this map is about the 1840s. So we're 1840s, 1850s. So this is the Liverpool, uh, the Liverpool and Manchester Railway Station. I'm not going to cut this much. Um, pretty much after it was built. So this would have been still very much in use. At the time, you can see there's lots of these little things here. These are little turntables. This map is really ridiculously detailed. It's crazy. And you can see all the tracks going through here to give you an idea of where we are in the city. Let me just zoom out just a little bit and we'll fade through to the modern maps. So this is now obviously the Mosey, the Museum of Science and Industry. Um, so that's the main warehouse, which is not even there uh, on these maps. So all this um, new street, that's gone. Um, you know, by this time, that's just not there. Uh, you have the 1830 warehouse, obviously that is present on the modern maps, that's still there. It's really weirdly shaped, I never realised it was shaped like that before. Um, there's a, a building here that's just, just not there anymore. Um, there's a whole another building here that's just gone. Um, yeah, so we'll flip through some maps and we'll see what interesting features we can spot. Um, there's even more going on up here, look. What's going on here? Bywater Tunnel. Well, well, well. There's a lot going on here. There's a lot, there's a lot. I love these maps, there's so much going on, I could get very distracted just on this little bit itself. Um, let's have a, oh, oh, oh no, I found a manure pit, oh dear. Anyway, let's flick through the years. Let's go to a little bit more recent. Uh, does this have a map series, will it load in? Uh, obviously not, I don't know if it has any maps. Oh, there we go. It did load it. It just reminded. It just, I just needed to scroll to space to see it. Uh, what year is this one? Let's have a look. Uh, we're looking 1840s to 1890s. That's a really big, broad view. Doesn't look like I can see what year this is from. <laughs> this is just a map. But we are a little bit later on in the life of the Liverpool Manchester. Let's have a look what's here. Okay, so most of the modern buildings are now here. That street that was there, long gone. You can still see the old entrance way over here, actually, I guess. That'd be that one. If you just go back to the previous map series. Uh, no. No, it was over here. Charles Street. There's a lot going on here, historically. Would have been there, wouldn't it? Let's face it. That's the old entrance. Still lots of these little turntables. Still a good shed here. This is pretty much the same layout it is now. So this would have the, um, like the steam engines in it that you go and see, but that's been closed off now. There's a tramway here, obviously that'd be the Manchester Corporation tramway, that's not like an industrial one. We've still got the railway here. We'll head out and we'll see what we can see before this map series ends, we have to go to the OS maps. Or the main series OS maps, so uh, let's head out this way. We're going over Prince's Bridge. Let's actually go back to the first map, let's see how much things have changed between these two. Look, can see these, there's a whole another bridge here that's just appeared. There's a whole lot different here. Oh, look, London and Northwestern Railway. Northern Division, that's heading off towards Victoria. New Bailey Prison, wow. Check out that, they don't want you to know what's in there. Salford Railway Station, that's the prison. Yeah, that, that scans. Um, we're, we're veering away, we've gotten distracted already. Liverpool and Manchester. So we're coming up here, we're going over the river, over the Irwell, uh, heading out towards Liverpool. There's the track obviously stop here and see where we are in the modern day ah so we've got the Audsall cord over here you can see where it's severed the old route that bridge is very old crikey if it's in if it's contemporary with the old Liverpool Manchester railway that's very old indeed 
we're heading out here. Lots of tracks going on here. But Ultra Lane Works, that is now a... Not there. Continuing. Lime Station. That is now a... Junction. That's a huge junction. Whoa, look at that. Heading off that way up there. Guessing that's not on this map at all. Nope. We'll keep going until we encounter something else on the old map. Liverpool and Mountain Deception. Look, there we go. Brickfield. What? Brickfield. 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 What's a brickfield? And that's where the map ends. Let's see if we've got more map a little bit later on. There we go. Oh, wow. What have we found here? Cross Lane Station, which is now a roundabout. Nice one. Lovely. Look at all this here. Cross Lane Cattle Station. Any remnants of that at all? Nope. Not even there's a road name called like Cow Lane. You've got Joe Street. Keep going. Cross Lane. Got lots here. Clay Pit and Brickworks. There we go. I'm guessing that's a nothing. Yep. Does this mean that moved? Oh no, that's the A Road. Oh, the M Road. It's the M602. Taking up the alignment that was these houses. Sorry guys, you become a motorway. Let's keep going. What's this? Seedley Station. What is that? Nothing. That's gone. <laughs> Let's keep going. Oh look, check this out. Manchester Carriage and Tramway Company Stables. Look at that, you've got the, the old tram network coming in here. Obviously that's the end of the old maps. That's nothing at all. Hayworth Street has retained its name. Look, Hayworth Street there. That's retained its name. Right, let's change our map series to the 1892 series. This is the one I'm most familiar with. Wow, that's gone even at that standard, even at that point. Let's keep following the line. Ah, yes, I remember this part where it, it fades to nothing. There we go, it's building it in. There we go. Right, at Weast Station. It's gone. Just going to assume most of these are gone. Oh look, we've got another line coming in underneath here. Coming in underneath, and um, that's the Manchester Docks branch. So I'm just guessing that heads to the docks. There's, uh, there is a whoa, 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 my goodness, Salford Docks. Do you need? Oh, my God, that is a lot of railways. I'm guessing that's all gone. Well, no, it's obviously the Salford Keys area, but all the railways are gone. There's got to be some remnants of the railways there. There's got to be some odd track left embedded in the road. Weast Cemetery. I mean, yeah, it was a cemetery back then too. I guess people died in the past. Tramway! Found a tramway. Yeah, look at this. This is the sort of thing I like, these old tramways. Wait for it to load in a bit more. We'll investigate this small tramway. Where are we? Seedley Station. So this might be on the old maps. Let's have a look what it is now. Yep, okay, thought so. Let's go back a series. 1888. Not there. It's a very short lived railway. That's a very short lived tramway indeed. Moving on from Weast Station, we're going to head this way. Obviously, that line is. Oh, that line is there! I thought that would have gone. Look at that! That goes all the way down there. I'm guessing Coronet Way follows the alignment of the railway. Nope, I was wrong. But whatever this is, is this Metrolink? That's got to be Metrolink, yeah? Well, no, that just stops. That's still heavy rail. That's neat. I've never seen that before. I didn't even know that existed. A little branch line. That's a remnant from the old days. Still comes up under the LMR. And rejoins in the same area. Yep, and we found another station. Eccles. Now, I know that is a actual station that's got a Metrolink stop because you can catch the tram to Eccles. So that must be Metrolink then. I'm confused now. But yeah, that's Eccles. We'll keep moving on. Eccles Junction. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, there's a lot of track here. I guess we're going to have to wait for it to load in and fade it and see if it's anything left at all of all this so what we've got here we've got an engine shed we've got the patch cross sidings which looks like a tramway on it no nope, that's just a border uh, so we've got massive engine shed a massive brass and iron foundry magnesium works uh, we've got loads of houses nearly spelling out the word here it's 
trying to make things. We've got this road here, Shakespeare Crescent. Lots of stuff going on. These are just like empty. I wonder what they would have looked like. Probably just brownfield sites. But yeah, let's fade through the map and see what's left of this. Oh, that's sad. That's really sad. But you can still see the shape of it outlined here. You've got that triangular shape still visible. This is obviously the alignment of a railway going through the middle there. So it's now been obviously taken up with this industrial complex. Uh, let's go back. There's more railway going through here. Well, that's not a railway. It's not. It's a canal. Hmm, interesting. The Ellesmere Iron Foundry will keep going towards Liverpool. Ship Canal Ropery. That's interesting, isn't it? And it's gone. There it is. There it isn't. There it is. There it isn't. There it is. Anyway, uh, keep moving on. Now, this gets a bit interesting. Look at this. We go from how many tracks? Four tracks to two tracks, but it looks like, they're, uh, like the embankment is large enough for more than that. Because look, that looks like there's an extra embankment level there. So maybe this had more tracks in the old days. But this is the old LMR, which was double tracked, I believe. So I doubt it. Oh, we found a station. Let's see if this is still there. No, Barton Moss road maintaining the name of the station but not there let's keep on trucking do we find another feature i smell a tramway that's a tramway isn't it, it can't just be alignments that's the trap yes it is it's a tramway we found some tramways the barton moss tramways by the look of it <laughs> in case you didn't know where you are barton moss barton moss barton moss lots of tramways here what's this 12 yards road tramway there's a lot of tramways here what's this now oh interesting it's still a thing i'm guessing there's no evidence of the tramways here that's curious i wonder if i can street view that how much of that is street viewable now i've got to find it on google maps Okay, so here's Manchester. We're heading out Barton Moss. That's got to be it here, right? Yes, Barton Moss. Okay, let's have a look if we can find something that's definitely a tramway and a very distinctive feature that we can find. Um, so yeah, that's obviously a tramway. A lot of tramway action going down here, and the that's a golf club. Well, that's a distinctive feature we can find. You can find the golf club. There's the golf club. So this is all tramway here. Twelve yards road. Is any of it placeable? It is. Ooh, welcome. To a tramway. This is what a lot of my research comes to in the end. Um, just going on street view. Is there anything left here of tramways at all? I'm guessing it's all gone. Anything under the road? Any rails at all? At least it looks accessible, kind of. I mean, I could if I wanted to come out all this way, make a video on this, but I need to obviously do more research. Uh, let's see where the tramway might have gotten to. So let's follow it. So it goes this way, goes down here. I'm assuming it's huge. Come on, check out that. That would be a neat feature to see if it's still there. Um, Astley Road. Now, where did we see Astley Road? There's Astley Road. So where would that tramway alignment would have been? You can still see a little bit there. There's a farm on one side and a little house on the other. So here's where that tramway went zoop, across there. So let's see if that's placeable. It is. Any evidence at all? None whatsoever. Doesn't look like an area I'd like to drive up and down. What on earth is that? Like a, a skeleton of a digger. But that's an embankment for a tramway, definitely. That's brilliant. Nothing in the road, so any infrastructure would have been taken up. But it cut across the road. Oh, hello. Where have we gone? Is that the uh, embankment going the other way? I'm guessing it is. Yeah. So that's the tramway embankment. That's been blurred out. How dare you look at tramways, you naughty man. Is it blurred out in this one? Now, nah. so that's obviously another alignment. This looks a lot like the Wilmslow tramway. So I'm guessing this is like a peat bog sort of area. Uh, not sure what it is actually. Um, but the tramway then goes this way up here. It stops. It's got to connect to the railway somewhere. All tramways connect to a main piece of industry somewhere or main piece of infrastructure. They don't just exist in isolation often. They often go from somewhere to somewhere. It goes all the way down here. Tramway. Oh, I didn't expect. I did not expect it to go to Earlham. It doesn't go to Earlham. It stops just short of Earlham Station. And then it goes off this way. Oh, just a little branch of it goes off that way. 
Well, we're at Earlham. Hello, Earlham. Does any of it connect here? No, but we have found another tramway. <laughs> going up this way. Or is this just a branch line? Uh, mineral railway. That's like the next level up from a tramway. And that follows the Manchester Ship Canal. Okay. Um, right, where were we? We're trying to find where this tramway connects up. It's got to connect somewhere to the LMR. It's got to. It's just a matter of finding it. That looks like a main trunk route going up this way. It's not the tramway anymore. Okay, let's go the other way. Let's go from the Manchester Railway and find where the tramway connects to it. It has to at some point, surely. Is that it there? No, that's clearly a road. Astley Station, still no tramway. Oh, here we go. We're close. Astley Moss Farm. Tramway, tramway, lots of tramway. Oh, 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 we're getting there. It crosses over the boundary. It goes near the railway. Come on, load in, load in, load in. What, what, why aren't you loading? I need to load, I need to see this. There's even more, oh my gosh, there's another one on the other side. What? <laughs> what? Just gonna zoop, transport fever this. That's like what you do in Transport Tycoon. Is that still there? <gasps> the bridge is still there! Whoa, that's crazy, that's mad. Obviously that's a golf course, everything's a golf course. Ooh, look at this alignment here, see that hedge going that way? Zoop, tramway. Is this all the same network? That's bizarre. I'm gonna have to check uh, rail map online. As soon as it loads in this section, which I think would be where it all connects. Ah, uh, this is taking a while. Come on, load in. I wanna see where it connects. Let's have a look at the main map while we have a chance. Oh, nothing's working. They just don't want me to load into Glazebury. This is forbidden territory, it seems. Hmm. Okay, I guess we're going to go investigate this way. Everything's gone blurry. Why? What? Why? Why do the maps hate me? Is this where the video ends? Does it end on the cliffhanger? Do I have to say... Join me next time where we continue from this section looking at the tramway. Please like the video and subscribe. Let me know if you like this kind of content. I'll do more. It's been quite relaxing, actually. Much more relaxing doing this than climbing up a hill. So, um, yeah, I'll catch you next time where we resume from this point on our journey on the Liverpool and Manchester Railway. Going from Manchester to Liverpool. I'm waffling in hopes it will load in, but I don't think it will. So that's the end of this video. Catch you next time.